All right, so here is my geometry binder that I put together. I have, um, I have a pencil pouch in the front. I have the table of contents that I ripped out from the very front of our book. And I, don't, I did not have you do this during our Zoom. During the Zoom, I only had you rip out unit three. Unit three, page 307. And the learning targets, we put them in the very front. So the learning targets are in the very back of unit three. The, un the learning targets are in the very back of each unit. So whatever the learning targets are for a unit, you'll find them in the back. To me, it makes more sense to put these learning targets in the very front. So here they are, here's what we've already done. We should already have page 307 to page, oh, what is it? To page 430, all ripped out and in our binder. And then after we got to the end of page 430, we found the learning targets. So learning target 13 to learning target 16, okay? Those learning targets went right behind this page 307. And then in the front of page 307, you want to have the tab divider 3. And then at the end of unit 3, you, you want to make a tab divider, or if you have a store-bought one, for unit 4. So unit 3 ends on page 430, and then you have a tab divider for unit 4. Your book does have unit 4 in it. You don't need to rip it out and put it in there right now. Uh, if you think you're going to lose your book, then maybe you should rip out the pages for Unit 4 and put them in there. I need you to have a tab for the glossary. And then the glossary is in the back. It's the yellow pages. Glossary GL1 to GL16. Yellow pages. That used to be a thing. <laughs> Anyway, uh, the very last page is the index page, and it's just a single page, so I just tucked it in my pocket, uh, the back pocket of my binder. All right, so have fun with it or keep it simple. I like uh, having fun with things, so I try to have a little pizzazz in my binders. To make the uh, tabs, you can use washi tape. So here's just some good old washi tape, uh, and you just peel off about that much, I guess, and tear it, and then stick it. I think, well, I shouldn't say I think. You should have these staggered, so I'll open my binder back up so you understand what I mean by staggered. You don't want to have these all, if you make these, you don't want them all up at, the, up at the top of the page. So stagger them. So I'll show you what I mean by staggering when I'm done here. So then uh, this is unit three. So I can just write, I think a Sharpie would work better on this tape than this pen. Or you can just use good old Scotch tape. The ones that I have in my binder right now are with masking tape. And this is what I mean by staggered. So they don't, they're not, one's not right under the other. I can see them on their own without moving the other one. So washi tape is just like masking tape. The scotch tape you can use the same way. I think you could write right on them. But from what I've experienced in the past is when you write on the scotch tape, it starts to rub off. So you could put a piece of paper. This is just a colored post-it note. You could just cut a little square out and you can write on it and then it won't, it won't rub off. So we'll just say this is unit three again, just as an example. It's not very pretty three, but that's a three for now. So take your scotch tape, stick your colored or just any paper, just having fun with it. I'm not doing a good job. I'm uh, working kind of awkwardly with my iPad on top of my boxes here. But that's how um, you can make your homemade dividers. Just trying to keep us organized so we have a little more success and happiness and less frustration semester. And my pen is rubbing off on this one. So definitely use a Sharpie. All right. So this is kind of, I don't need you to show me that you made these, but how I was going through the binder, that's how I need you to show me in the Flipgrid video that you put your learning targets in the front and you made your dividers and that you have notebook paper. Please show me you have notebook paper. Okay? Okay.